testing out some new styles. Uh, you can see them on the table right there. That's the Gunslingers. Men's. American Salvage Denim. Um, and I'll show you the jeans that I'm working on today. See, we have the new Zaki Z Myers and Sons leather label. New rivets. Salvage edge there on that uh, back pocket. Front. Today I'll put both the buttonholes here and buttons on there, buttons up here. I have to put the uh, belt loops on. They come down here since it's a salvage. I'm going to show off this salvage edge. I'll have to hem the bottom of this and fold this edge back. By the way, I'm listening to the sound of some kind of weirdo. One of the best mixes I've heard in a long time. So here we are over at the keyhole. So right now, I just got done oiling it. And uh, you can see that's what it does. I just finished this pair. Every stitch is accounted for. A pair of Zach and Denim. Count on that. Okay, belt loops. Already cut the denim here. Is he denim? And we'll run it. Check the back side to make sure that the uh, stitch is beautiful as it is. And run a couple feet worth. So I just finished cutting belt loops, five belt loops, because there's usually five per jean, four inches long, and um, I'm going to use this bar tack machine right here. This bar tack machine uh, does reinforced bar tack stitches for belt loops, pockets, different areas on the jean that require reinforcement. Um, this machine next to it is also a bar tack machine. Um, basically does wider and thicker uh, bar tacks. This actual jean right here that I'm uh, one of the three that are being finished this evening, this is for a friend of mine, Brian Gibbons, out in Los Angeles. And I'm looking forward to sending these to him. Apparently I was blocking the camera on that last one. But you can see, we just did a belt loop. So I'm going to show you this time. The bar tack machine pretty aggressive. I have about 10 years experience with this machine. We go way back. And there you have it. Uh, all five belt loops have been bar tacked successfully on. Two front. Three back. I guess I could, while I'm here, do some more bar tacking to kind of show you what some of the other uh, applications it's used for. Uh, for example, I'll bar tack this back pocket up here at the top. So there you can see how I <clears throat> did two bar tacks to reinforce this pocket. Um, for this pocket style right here, the rivets are more of a uh, decorative feature, whereas the bar tacks are more of a functional reinforcement. So we just bar tacked this back pocket.
Then we have one side hand up. Now I can go over and put the buttons in. And there we have it. All right, I've enjoyed this little demonstration. Best wishes.